Hi everyone. How are you going? I hope you're okay. In this video I want to show you how I grow sedum stone crop in my garden. Do you like this plant? The sedum stone crop is the tall sedum. It looks very beautiful. Look at this. This is my flower bed with the great sedum flower. I like these big flowers. Large clumps of tall sedums can be propagated via division or via stem cuttings too. How to grow stone crops these plants were suggested to me by my neighbor see what they look like i can cut them apart and replant where i want new young plants let's do it together I have six new pieces of sedum. Now I will make a border near the alley of the house. How do stone crops reproduce? The fastest way to propagate this plant is by dividing it into parts. Dig up the base of an existing plant and cut off a few pieces. You can plant these stone crop parts directly in your garden. Another simple method of propagating sedum is propagation by stem cuttings. Cut a few stems from each plant and transplant the stem cuttings into a seed tray with damp sand. If this is done in the spring, then you can transplant the cuttings directly into the garden. How fast does stone crop spread? The propagation rate of this plant depends on the species, climate, soil and fertilizer. Creeping stone crops are ridiculously easy to breed. Pick up or cut off a few stems and place them on top of the potting soil, or stick them shallowly into the potting soil. I removed these stone crops from my garden because they are very aggressive plants. Dividing the mother bush is a very effective method of sedum propagation. I use this very often for other plants as well. Most sedums are drought-tolerant succulents with thick, fleshy leaves. These plants prefer full sun and well-drained soil. Well, it's done. I will see the result of my work in the spring. I hope you find this video useful and interesting. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.